Hi there, my name's Adam and today I'm going to show you how this wonderful Lavio dry flush toilet works. This video is perfect if you've just bought one of these systems or if you're doing your due diligence to better understand how they work. Now to kick things off, I just want to explain quickly what is inside the body of the toilet that isn't already taken out here on the table. So aside from what you see on the table, there is a battery in the back here, a rechargeable battery, which we're going to show you how to activate in just a moment. There is a fan that makes the bag inflate and vacuum and wrap and do all that stuff that you've probably seen already on the internet. And there is a motor underneath here which spins around like this inside of here. What that actually does is it spins around this receptacle here which sits inside of the body of the toilet when it's all set up and it turns it around which is what actually wraps the Mylar bags for you. Now what's really important to understand when we put this inside of there it's very important that the male part of the motor that you just saw on screen fits into that square. If this is all wobbly inside there, it's because you haven't jiggled it around and dropped it down onto that motor. So make sure that when you put the bin inside the toilet, as we're gonna do in a moment, that it drops down and you'll know when it's in place because you'll hear it going back and forward. In fact, I might just do a quick demo of that now. I'm gonna open the lid here. I'm gonna put this over into the toilet and we're gonna play with it here and you'll hear it go clunk like that. And you'll see it turning like this you're about to hear the motor winding when it's on that male part correctly so that's where that goes now to actually set this up the way that we have to do it first of all is you get the master garbage bag which comes with your cartridges when you order it now again if you've just bought one of these systems this will all come packed in uh, and ready to go for you in the system there's nothing more that you need to do so you simply put that garbage bag liner inside the white bag, then you get the elastic band that comes with it, and you put that elastic bag down over the toilet. Now, what I would do next is put that into the base of the toilet and being sure that it's locked in there correctly, like what I just showed you, which it now is. Now, the next step, of course, is putting your bagging cartridge. This is the Mylar bagging cartridge that you've seen in all the videos. There's about five meters of Mylar bag inside of this cartridge. And what you wanna do is you wanna make sure that the hexagonal shape of the base lines up with the hexagonal shape of the garbage bin so that when the garbage bin turns inside, it's twisting those bags for you. So that's all you do is you pop that in there and you push it down to the bottom. And then the important part is on this rim, you'll see there's two little indentations, one there and one there. And we wanna make sure that we line those indentations up with these two parts of the toilet seat. That's all you need to do. And then the last step is you grab this little piece here and you pop that over the top. And now we have the bin in there with the master garbage bag over the top. We've got the cartridge sitting in there and lined up correctly and we've got that there ready to go. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna spin the toilet around and show you how to set it up for your first use because if you've bought one of these toilets it will actually come all set up correctly like what we've just seen there i would just check to make sure that the bin is in place inside the bin correctly by just gently turning it see if you can hear the motor winding but otherwise it will be all good to go so what i'm going to do is i'm going to turn the toilet around so you can see the back of the toilet and what we need to do when we're going to do this initial uh, setup because what we want to do is we want to get that bag that's in there we want to get it sucked out nice and wide and clean so you've got that big clean fresh bowl for the first use now the very first thing we need to do is we need to pull out these wires and there's two wires that are going to come out the back the first one with the red and the black this is your charging point now this here is what you will run. There's a, in the box, a cord that runs to the wall where you can just charge that into the wall and you should charge this battery up for one hour a month, no more. And when you're done, completely disconnect it from the wall. So it's all done. And then what happens is the second one here, which is the uh, outlet from the battery. And we're just gonna plug that straight into that little hole that's under there. And now we have power from the battery to the motor so that we can do this last step. Now, if you open the lid, you'll see that in here, the bag is all fluffy and it's not really ready to use as it is. The battery is connected. So what we wanna do is start the flush cycle by pushing the flush button, and that's gonna suck the bag out to the sides of the bowl and make it ready for the first use, but we're not gonna let it run its full flush cycle where it twists the bag and all does all that. 
All we're gonna do is pull it out after two seconds to create that fresh bowl. When it's done, we just simply plug the battery back in and we are good to go. So here's how you do it. You have one hand on the battery at the back, just to that cord, and you have one on the flush button. You flush the button, you see it's a nice full bowl, about two seconds, then you unplug at the back there the cord and the bowl is now clean and ready for use. All you need to do now is plug that battery back in and you are good to go with your brand new Lavio dry flush toilet.